What's going on, guys? My name is Jace Machine. We are playing Star Maid here on the Star Squadron survival server. I hope you guys are doing well. I am, uh, I'm sick. I've got the cold. I've got the cold, Pa. And, uh, so if my voice sounds a little, uh, a little more gravelly or congested than usual, that's why. So this is the, uh, the walls of my control command center. We put these up, uh, between videos here. I'm just sitting on a block here. I plan on dropping this down and this one even further down, but it occurred to me that we do need to grab some materials and there is an easy selection of free materials back at my old planetary plate which is just floating around in space right now so let me come in here we're gonna shut this door cuz you know that's what my mom raised me all right so we're going to uh, take we're gonna take our spaceship here activate our radar jammer to prevent any sneaky pirates from getting us and let's see about finding where the planet is. At least our plate. Nine thirteen five. I think that is where my planet is. get this thing going at max speed and then we'll just leave her alone and hope that we don't run into any suns on the way. You know, it's times like this when I'm thinking, man, why didn't you install a jump drive? That should be what we're going to do today as well. So we'll install a jump drive onto this guy. That way our trips back and forth from these places aren't as long. Looks like clear skies from here on out. We should be just fine. No suns in our path. I would like to welcome Raven to the server. He just did his first Let's Play on the Star Squadron survival server. You can watch it in the annotated link. I hope I have put something in there for you guys to click on. Uh, you can check out his channel in the description of my own. He's listed in there. And uh, I have to say, Raven, that your arrival on the Star Squadron server just so freshly after this, the main planet got blown up by a mysterious party, hmm? I'm not pointing any fingers, but I'm just saying it's very suspicious timing that you should just show up. Whose side are you on, huh? Whose side are you on? Speaking of factions, look, we know we formed this Laramar alliance. It's a fondness, a mutual fondness for Laramar. I don't think there's anything really suspicious about the fact that we like Laramar. There's plenty of Laramar in the galaxy. I don't think we're trying to get a lockdown on all of the Laramar, as uh, these guys, the the, 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 the the fairy folk, I'm not sure what their name is, these free free hippie guys, yeah, I, we're not trying to take their Laramar, we're just trying to make sure that they don't take our Laramar, huh? That's a big distinction. Speaking of big distinctions, I don't even know why Craze Nala has aligned with himself with those guys. Apparently he said I called him out or something, but I've watched the, the video that got leaked of uh, the United Laramar Alliance's um, meeting, you know, and I mentioned him. Apparently just mentioning him is enough to make him your enemy for life. Thanks, Nally, for taking things a little far. All I said about him was that his that he had gone off into deep space, which he had. I don't I wasn't saying that he had anything to do with the events, but apparently he's either guilty in aligning himself with these people or I don't know I'll have to look into that I have to admit that I don't appreciate your snarkery gmodism using that ridiculous rainbow unicorn logo 
All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are approaching my planetary plate. Let's uh, adjust our approach vector and bring up our HUD. Yep, 18 kilometers away. We're going to come back to it. We're going to get some jump drive bits. That's if I don't happen to have it on my own plate here. Yep, there's my beacon. Grab the filter and get a lot of this stuff off. We don't need it. We know where we're at. We're fine. Everything is fine. Ships don't need it. Hello, my little planetary plate of goodness. Where are we going to park? That's a damn good question. A valid question. Um, I got this. Nailed it. Huh? Huh? We good here? We good? We're great. This is great. See? This ship's fine. Man, we have not been back to this plate uh, since the event occurred. I'm, I'm quite pleased that it turned out as well as it did, though. Uh, some of the plates got these gigantic, crazy glitch holes in them. I don't know don't know what caused them I'm not going to speculate don't really want to speculate to be honest but we have a lot of good stuff here uh, the stuff that is nailed down we're going to use a salvager and the stuff that's not nailed down which is in the chest we are going to uh, grab by hand question mark marker beams I think Nally needed a marker beam I'm going to give him one, but, you know, since he decided that he was going to be my enemy. <laughs> now, Nally, if you want a marker beam, come see me. I'll give it to you. Uh, yeah, these these are actually places where I've pulled materials out already. These used to be factory enhancers, in fact. I'm just checking on certain things. Things that I might want to take with me. Other stuff I really don't care about. Black advance, it's pricey and expensive. I should keep it. You know, you should sell some of this stuff, Jace. It's kind of hilarious. It looks fine. That's why it looks hilarious, I think. It gets leveled out and everything. Oh, that's great. All right, we're gonna stuff some of this stuff in here because saying stuff is really descriptive. All right, we got a shop right there. Let's make sure that we are slowing down. Don't want to overshoot, and we don't want to crash into it either. I guess. Wondering if there is a dock. I know some of the shops have received dock upgrades recently. Do you see any docks? What's up, dock? Nope, no docks. Drop to sell. I like this. All right, let's start dropping these to sell. Yes, please. Shop, how can we ran out of money? Curse you, shop. All right. Let's do a little wheeling and dealing here, shop. All right. I want a jump drive. Do you know what I'm talking about? Give me jump drive computer right now or I mess you up. All right. We're going to buy uh, one and we're going to buy a handful of these. Uh, how many do we want? I don't know. Like 50? Sure, right? Huh? Now can we sell these again? Drop to sell. Yeah. All right. Well, I got a bunch of extra crap, um, but we got what we needed. So let's go into build mode and make this thing happen. All 
right, we got a couple of other shops around here that we can option on. Let's go to this one real quick. Map the jump drive. Uh, yeah, why not? To five. Sounds great to me. Ah, beautiful. Shopkeep, show me your wares. Or let me show you mine. <laughs> uh. I think we overshot it. Yes, we did, but not by much. Let's switch over to our salvaging array. And as always, we're watching our speed as we are approaching. Alright, plate. Oh, you're glitchy. Yes, you are. Look at this. I can fly through it. Watch. No, me not. Yes. Yes. Can I do anything about this? Uh, no. All right. It looks wonky. Let's uh, let's relog here real quick. <laughs> I just had this guy come knocking at my door, and he's like, "Oh man, I'm really sorry to bother you, but I'm a truck driver out of Pensacola, and I just had a lady default on a, on some stakes." And, uh, you know, I really need to get rid of them. And I'm like, dude, <laughs> I'm broke as a joke, sir. Oh, all right. I'm sorry, man. Hi. Oops. See, he's trying to distract me from my work for some reason, this Robin Shield. Actually, Robin Shield is a cool cat. I like this dude. Uh, he has not done anything wrong by me. He's not even sure if he wants to be associated with those other guys, which is just fine with me. I don't have any problems with the guys who, uh, who don't want to be associated with anyone. I just, I'm all I'm saying, all, all I'm saying is that Gmodism and track art have been a little bit suspicious lately. I'm not pointing fingers, but I think they're guilty. Oh, it feels so weird just ripping all this stuff out. I remember all the work we put in, all those fun episodes in season one where we were building this thing. It's okay. Goodbye, Golden Pyramid of Goodness. Goodbye, Factory of Assorted Things and Stuff. Look at that, all those capsules. I'm losing some stuff, aren't I? Mm, that's just too bad. Well, if we can fly through it and collect it, uh, I'll, I'll be pleased. Come on now. Come on now, Grandma. We can fit. Oh, no. Oh, the chaos. Oh, I love it. Though. Look at those doors just collapsing. Oh, that's so cool. Get this big old boy in here now. Let's rip this top out a little bit. Huh? Oh, looks like we've met our maximum. All right. Let's take a look. Remember that car? Okay, we're full. And we have plenty of room for the cargo still. Why can't we get this then, huh? Why can't we not get this? I say. Because it's not designed to get? It's not designed to get. Okay. This is what we're going to do. We're going to get. We've got some of it. This inventory is full. This inventory is now also full all right guys we are full so that means we can go home and 
we'll come back another day and see if we can't pick up some of the rest of the stuff here. Alright, we're calling it the Embassy Plate. Yes, very good. Okay, and let's go home. Alright guys, it is time to go home. All right, may it be so humble. There is no place like home. It's good to be home. We need to dock this guy. And it should take a bunch of stuff and put it into storage here. So, boop. I'm told that saying boop makes it work better. <laughs> All right, so now is this thing actually working? Which by working I mean, is it sucking? Does this thing suck? Yes. Yes it is. This thing definitely sucks. And so it's working perfectly. As I bump into a computer. Alright, back home. Drawn pictures of mountaintops. With him on top. Lemon yellow sun. Sorry. For the keen. Oh, girl. You are a fool. Look at you. We gotta do something about this next episode, guys. Look at all this beautiful Laramar. Oh, I love the Laramar. You know, the ladies love the Laramar, too, I'm hearing. I, that does not go in there. That's also what I've been told. It's good to be back at the home. I am glad to be here. Did this gun change? This gun? Nope, still the same gun. I think I need a new skin. What do you guys think? I need a new skin. That's what I've been thinking about. Everyone's getting these cool new skins, and I'm all like, oh, I want a cool new skin. But with that being said, guys, I love you all. Thank you so much for tuning in and watching this episode of uh, my Let's Play on the Star Squadron server. Like I said, Raven has started his own Let's Plays. Go check it out. Link to his channel in my description. In fact, I play Star Maid with a handful of very talented people. You should check out all of their works if you have the time. If you guys have any questions, comments, or criticisms, you know where to put them. If you have a criticism that can be corrected with a simple answer, I suppose that's even better. If you can give me the solution to a problem, I will gladly consider it. And if you guys are new around here, consider subscribing for more Star Maid content. I also play Seven Days to Die regularly, and every once in a while I'll throw up some Minecraft if I feel ornery. <laughs> and anyway, you guys, I love you all. I hope you have a wonderful time, and I will see you next episode. Hopefully by then I'll be feeling better. <laughs> <laughs>